I know Rin says it's wrong, but I can't get rid of this feeling that I know Kaylin and I had a connection. I'm so dumb. He has Lark. As much as I hate to say it, she has everything that I don't. It's Raiden. Oh my god, I totally forgot we had our date today. Good morning, beautiful. Are you ready for a date tonight? Hey, Raiden. Um, yeah, I'm totally ready, but I forgot to tell my parents. Uh-oh. This doesn't put a wrench in our plans, does it? No, of course not. I just think I should meet you there tonight. Is that okay? Totally. Well, I guess the surprise is ruined. I wanted to take you to that nice Italian place in town. You know, the one everyone at school has been talking about. Yeah, I do know. That sounds amazing. Um, so what time should I meet you there? Well, I was thinking about 7 o'clock. Is that too late? Nope, I will see you there, Raiden. I really can't wait. I can only imagine how beautiful you're going to look. <sighs> I don't even know what to wear. Adley, you look amazing. Thank you, Raiden. Are you hungry? I am practically dying from hunger. Well, I can't have my girl starving. Let's go inside. I have something really special planned for you. Raiden, what is all of this? It's dinner. You did this for me? Of course I did. I wanted to do something extra special for you. So, did I do good? <sighs> this is amazing, Raiden. Well, don't just stand there. <laughs> Let's eat. Wow, I think that was the best pizza I've ever had. I know, those Italians really know how to make a mean pizza. So, how did you pull all of this off, Raiden? Alright, you caught me. I did have some good connections. My dad actually happens to be a business partner with the owner of this place. So, I had him pull some strings for me. Hmm. Well, thank you for doing all of this. I mean... No one's ever gone through this much trouble on a date for me before. Haven't you ever had a boyfriend before? Oh, I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to overstep. We don't have to talk about it. No, it's okay. Um, yeah, I did have a boyfriend back home, but that's long over. Oh. Well, I definitely know what it feels like to have your heart broken. I think we've all been there. Wait, you? Mr. Popular? I seriously can't imagine anyone not jumping at the chance to be with you. <laughs> yup. I wasn't always like this, you know? 
In middle school, I actually was a lot more shy. But then, I guess I just got tired of being lonely and... I changed. She was a huge part of that. I know it probably seems like I'm a huge player. I can be a bit of a flirt and maybe I'm too forward. But in reality, you're one of the very few girls I have actually asked out in a couple of years. I guess... I don't know. Sometimes it becomes really hard to move on. Even though it's been so long. Sometimes I can go weeks without thinking about it. But then when I do, it feels like my whole world is crashing down. Or maybe I'm just being stupid and I need to move on. No, I know exactly how you're feeling. It's not even like you miss that person anymore or you want to be with them. You just like really miss what it once was. But then when you think about it, were those moments even real? How can something so beautiful turn sour so fast? <laughs> Finally, someone who understands. You never cease to amaze me, Adley. I guess I can just relate. <laughs> All these feelings and this pain, that's why I decided I just want to have fun during my youth. I want to make the most of my high school and just let go. I know that heartbreak is inevitable. My heart could get broken tomorrow if I let it. You know? Well, that's a pretty bleak way to put it. <laughs> but even though I know all of this, I still asked you to come here with me today. Because even if I do fall in love and it ends in heartbreak, I want to know these feelings and experience my life the way I'm supposed to. Wow. Brayden is amazing. Well... Let's just try to make our high school years the best that they can be then. Drama alert, guys. You must actually think I'm stupid. You declined every single one of my calls all weekend, so I know you were with her. How many times do I have to tell you that I wasn't? It is impossible for me to just want to spend one weekend alone. Stop lying. You were with him, right? I knew you seemed like the type to go for someone else's boyfriend behind their back. Hey, wait a second. Hadley wouldn't do that. Yeah, you have the wrong person, okay? Don't push your insecurities on other people. Keep it between you and your boyfriend. Why don't we hear it from her then? So what were you doing all day yesterday, Adley? We both know you were with Kaylin. Actually, she wasn't with Kaylin. She actually couldn't have been with him at all, because she was on a date with me. Wait, wait, what? You wanted to date with that loser? Enough! I wasn't with anybody at all. I was alone, and I'm sick and tired of all of this. Look around. Look at the scene you've caused. I'm done, Lark. We're done. What? Are you breaking up with me? Are you surprised? Look at this mess. Don't talk to me anymore. This relationship is over. Great. Now look what you've done. <laughs> 